This video is brought to you by my lovely patrons over on Patreon. I'd like to give a huge shout out to Anina, Clay, Mariah, Maddie, Edelis, Dre, Thomas, Tara, Zoe, Zuzia, Ainsley, Sabine, Jimma, Bailey, Azzy, Jacqueline, Monica, Jordan, Green, Lizzie, Willow, Danny, Blessing, Avery, Maddie, Alexia, B, Max, T, Taylor, M, Lovely, Antonina, Anna, Valen, Ali, Obsessed, Brianna, Nicole, Carnations, Kristen, Tequila, Autumn, Emily, Sarah, Vanessa, Nini, Nura, Macha, Ava, Yasmin, Leah, Kayla, Ali, Ginny, Vika, Inez, June, Elizabeth, Penguin, Sammy, Roland, Rose, Lydia, Mila, Adrian, Lexi, Baina, Chi, Madison, Beck, Jemaya, Mads, Rachel, Daisy, Honeybee, Jade, Hooves, Rose, Alice, Caden, Sponge, AJ, Kate, Jay, Praxin, Nicole, Terry, Hollow, Rebecca, Allison, Jacqueline, Jacaria, Mina, Lilith, Ange, Jasmine, Lizard, Haley, Kiki, Illyria, Lady Demista, Zebra, Lala, Ari, Amy, Busy, Molly, Xylosaurus, Rex, Lunaris, Galaxia, Maya, Novastar, Annie, Tori, Ariel, Bolchi, Bree, Zael, Jenny, Beastie, Leah, Arlo, Lena, Daddy, Marcella, Aaliyah, Holly, Diana, Molly, Syke, Els, Zoe, Elsie, Alui, Belette, Bruidar, Ariana, Hallowed, and Allison. If you'd like to support this channel and get some pretty nifty perks such as exclusive weekly audios and novel readings, the link is in the description. I cannot believe that we are here right now. You do realize this is a million percent the most bonkers thing that we have ever done. Yeah, no, for sure. In retrospect, that is pretty crazy. The fact that we took that and all the only word we had on the subject that we could trust was the person who gave it to us who we had like only known for a couple of weeks that is pretty nuts this still somehow tops that if it wasn't you who asked me and we didn't have the rapport that we do you know i would have absolutely said no to this right No, yeah, you would too. Imagine someone, not me, not one of your close friends, someone just comes up to you who you've known for a little bit and says, hey, there's this concert, right? Except it's like relatively exclusive and only a few influencers like myself have gotten invited to. It's this new music festival. I love music festivals. Do you love music festivals? Cool. It's this new music festival where there's going to be like less than a hundred people there. And it's a two night thing. And there are complimentary tents to hang out in and enjoy your time in. Uh, except it's in the middle of a field. It's in the middle of a field randomly that's like miles and miles and miles away from civilization. And also, you're going to get transported there in a limo with a bunch of other influencers. There's not going to be any cell service out there. They gave you all of those pieces of information. Even if, you know what, let's say it was your friend. Let's say it was your good friend. Just not me. You would look them in the face and say, no, yes, this is a good idea. We're going to do this and we're going to have a great time. Because I trust you implicitly. Because we have been through so many things together, so many crazy situations that... The, the thing I know for sure is that this is the apex. We're not getting past this. It's the, the situation as described as I did just now is crazy enough. The, the thing that's crazier than that is that it's real. Is that we're here and this is a real thing. The sound like, like the way that you described it was like, oh, this is going to be like a fire fest thing where it's not even remotely what it's been described as. But it is. It's real. There are people here. There are, I know these people. I've seen them on social media platforms. Well, yeah, no, but I know you're on social media platforms. Literally, you are like my best friend. So the, 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 the point is that like these and there are like real musicians here. 
There are real musicians here and not, and not just like musicians who, you know, oh, these are people that would usually headline tours. It makes sense that these people are here. Do you know who I saw setting up, getting ready to perform? Fleet Foxes. Fleet Foxes is here in the middle of a field. I need to like find the manager of whoever is running this like events wise, promotion wise, because I need invites to every single thing that they throw from now on. <sighs> Do you think they can, you can call me a micro influencer if I have like 20K on Instagram? Well, sure, it's reels and it's comedy, but it's 20K. Sorry, I'm not showing off my abs like the rest of the gentlemen here. Yeah, talk talk about like, wow. Jeez. Part of me just wants to take like a block of cheese and just rub it on him. <laughs> said that I don't, know. I don't know why that came out anyways um yeah no uh the point is like thank you i guess the point is that this is a once in a lifetime experience and we don't have any service and we have limited storage on our phones and i know you have your camera and that's cool but like people aren't gonna believe this there's nobody that's gonna believe this You have led me to many different places in the world, different corners of the earth, many perilous situations, but no, you have never led me astray before. Oh, I'm good. No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm, 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 I'm told you I'm psyched up about this whole thing. Oh, really? Is it that obvious? I'm giving vibe harsher. Oh, that, well, that's just not, that's not good for anybody. I'm pretty sure that if I even emanate, like give off, <laughs> I think it's emanate, but if I give off even like a smidge of vibe harsher vibes, I'm getting thrown out of here. I don't know how you can throw someone out of an open field, but they will find a way. Um, listen, I, this is something that probably isn't a great thing to do here. By here, I mean in the middle of a, a field surrounded by people that are like at least somewhat niche influencers, celebrity people um, on the internet uh, in famous bands and stuff is what I, is what I mean. Yeah, no. Um, <sighs> Do you mean that? No, you really mean that? Like you can't have a good, enjoyable time unless I'm also having a good, enjoy enjoyable time. I guess I was just a little checking because I also feel that way about you. Like I feel that way when you're sad. And I, I guess I just never knew that the feeling was reciprocated like that. You know what? I wasn't going to bring it up, but that co little comment from you maybe gave me a little bit of hope, so I will bring it up. I'll do it. I'm not scared. I ain't no joke. I used to let the mic smoke. Sorry. Uh, we have been on so many journeys together. Like I've seen you grow from this person who was shy on camera 
uh, and nervous around groups of people to one of the most confident, not cocky human beings I've ever met. I've like seen every single step from A to B and all the progress that you made. And you are just literally my role model now in the way that you handle yourself. And the fact that you have let me be your photographer and you have taken me on all of these amazing experiences and you have trusted me to like be the manager of your social medias. I, I don't know. You like, I know we have a, a business relationship as well now, but we've never let that bleed over into our personal relationship or vice versa. And I, you are the most, you were the, you're the greatest thing that's ever happened to me. And I was nervous about this. Like when you initially came with me, came to me with this pitch, it sounds like a scam, kind of just wild, right? And I, I, this realization hit me about halfway through your pitch. And it was that it does not matter how, bananas this sounds i'm gonna do it with you i would literally follow you anywhere into anything aside from maybe like certain demise yeah like of course i would do that as your manager naturally that's like what i would do but that's not exactly what i mean I meant it in more of a personal way. Like, like I like you a lot. <sighs> I know you like me a lot. I know, I know. And this is the hardest part of this because I'm about to do this in the middle of like a giant group, A, hate, uh, and B, in the middle of an uncomfortable and unfamiliar environment, B, hate. Uh, and also surrounded by potentially some of my musical idols, uh, hate, uh, I don't hate that, but I would, I hate, uh, <sighs> and, and God forbid this absolutely ruins our professional rapport, but I have to say it. Uh, I love you. Yeah. And. Before you say anything, you know I mean that. I, I The only people I, in my life I've ever said I love you to are my family members. In my immediate family. You are the first person outside of that group that I have said I love you to. And I know it. It's not something that I'm struggling saying. It's not something that I've been contemplating over for an extended period of time i know that i love you and i've known that i loved you for a while and it's not like oh i was trying to find the right moment for it to for moment to say it and then uh i said it now because obviously uh, you can ask anyone especially me this is not the right moment uh it was more so the emotions uh kept bubbling up inside of me and this was the moment that uh, they overflowed and it just kind of came out. So here we are. <laughs> you know, <laughs> slightly above, I don't feel the same way. The second worst thing you could have said was that. About time, about time, about time. So you knew about this and you just let me flounder around in my emotions. Okay. All right. <laughs> but then, then did you know that I, that's what I was going to say right now? <laughs> yeah, this, this really is, this really is kind of a psycho reveal place. This is. I couldn't help it though. I don't know. The fact that like two days ago when you asked me about this, like, I knew immediately I would go with you. 
when you started talking about it and I was like okay that's like true love like I really love you oh my gosh I got so I got so caught up in that the, the whole you saying about time I didn't even realize you hadn't said it back and then you just did say it back so that's wow Hey, um, so, uh, so, so what does this mean then? Well, I guess the question is, I am your best friend. I'm your photographer. I'm your manager. Uh, does this mean that I finally get to, uh, add boyfriend to the list of occupations? Do I have to update my LinkedIn? What's going to end? Yeah. Yeah, I know. We the, 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 I think I think they're set up. They're like really cute little like they're like a mix of like a yurt and a in a teepee, I believe. Yeah, no, we're not sharing with anyone else. That would be ridiculous. Yeah, the uh, next set is in the. F I mean, the first set is in about like half an hour. Do you think I can get what? Do yes, I do think I can get that done in half an hour. I will. Uh, I will lead. I will. I, I will lead the way. <laughs> I swear to God, I saw fleek foxes. I know they didn't leak it. I swear to God, I saw a flea. I was following. I was following.